folks, I just want to say this here. They'll probably fucking section me for saying it because I'm not allowed to fucking say this. The, uh, the information that I'm about to tell you now from my own heart, from my own soul, from my own experience, I'm actually not allowed to share it publicly because they'll say I'm fucking insane and I've lost a plot. But this is my true spiritual belief. The fucking demonic possessions that I had that were fucking removed by crying out for help, going, Jesus, help me. And then the demon shit itself and fucking left me. Like fucking, like a physical fucking uncontrolled me body, speaking in Latin like a classic fucking Bible. And furthermore, at the time, I wasn't even aware of all this Latin Bible demonic fucking bullshit apart from the fucking exorcist or something like that. Then when I read the Bible, I seen all this stuff as fucking... Like fucking classic, like fucking saying you're depressed and getting a Prozac. It's classic textbook fucking shit. The spiritual fucking story going back 2,000 years to the fucking birth and fucking resurrection of Jesus Christ. And it goes like this here. See aliens. Aliens are demons. Off-word entities. See all the other gods in the world, all the other word religions. They are worldly off word, this word is corrupt, ruled by the devil. They are not gods, they are actually demons. All our religions are to take you away from Christ and therefore under the Christian doctrine that therefore makes them anti-Christian and anti-Christ. And what is anti-Christ? Any God taking you away from the Lord himself will be a demon. And all these other fucking people, gods that people are praying to, these are all demons, these are praying to, when you should be fucking relieving your own fucking son, don't look at me and say he's done son, we've all fucking sinned, we've all made mistakes, but God fucking died in the flesh for you to renew your soul with the Holy Spirit and earth, they prepare for the next dimension folks, and we're going to the fucking next dimension, and you're going to fucking see it, and it ain't all fucking, oh I just fucking fall away, and I fucking become nothing, bullshit, a vacuum can't create a void. There's only ever consciousness. When this when this consciousness dies, it can only take another form. Dark rooms are only there for eyes that can see it. That's what consciousness is. You won't be locked in a dark room. You won't experience nothing. You will be a something else. But yeah, there's always that. I may have to take my meds tonight just to keep the fucking psychiatrist off me, but this is what I'm saying. Jesus Christ is the fucking real. Demons are off-word entities. UFOs, all these all, all are word fucking, like, like it says in the Bible, the wheels in the sky. Like if you look at that recent fucking footage with the fucking UAP flying through the fucking American Air Force base, go back to that Da Vinci picture from the 14th century. That Da Vinci involved the wee fucking UFO with the spindly legs. That's exactly what's flying through that fucking US Air Force base. This goes back 2,000 years to antiquity. This is an age old story. It's just in this modern world, we've been so far taken away from Christ and the Western world that we're, we've lost touch with the real fucking Christians like the fucking Orthodoxes in Russia and stuff like that. But let me tell you, Christ is coming back and I believe it 100%. Jesus Christ is a reality and nobody ever took that away from me. And what happened to me was a spiritual experience. It wasn't a psychiatric diagnosis. You can take that to the fucking bank. Believe it. Don't believe it. I don't care. I'm not here to convince you either. I'm not here to... I'm not doing nobody harm by having an opinion. People, psychiatrists say, oh, you're probably scared. People say that. Bullshit. I'm just having my own fucking opinion about this spiritual experience called life. So fucking deal with it. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying.